Good morning, YouTubers. It's a beautiful, beautiful day today. Sun is out. Here we go. Super, super good. Nice weather today. See that? So you can see the system is now float mode just this morning sun is really 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 good you know i was working on the system all night and um happened to go as fast as sleep and uh three hours <clears throat> later the sun came out so i missed some hours of the sun <laughs> and the system did pretty good yesterday you know and uh we just now we just started and uh okay i uh, see here you can hear the 48 volt system is still doing good everything is fine <clears throat> we are now in full mode. Yes, we are making power here. Really making power. See that? Sitting on float. 100%. See that? Using the power coming from the sun right away. It's not like the batteries at all. There you go. housing is in full load right now our well, system is in a full mode look at that television is on everything is fine chest freezer is running everything is nice and cool even this bad boy is running as well everything is nice and cool as you can see and this is an energy star and there's a little LED here is on so just show you that the system is running, take it the entire house. See? It's energy star. Really cool. Really, really, really cool. Chest freezer. And you know what? This is the first time now the fan just kick in. You know, all the stuff is running. All the stuff is running. So, well, it's now finally we drew. Um, we have a minus. We started taking from the battery a little bit. Minus point. 1.4 this is what we bring in right now that's in full load there we go
we are currently pulling a 274 watt at 2.64 amps these are the amps we the entire system is taking very 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 efficient if that was like a 12 volt something it would have been probably 15 amps or very close to um, 18 amps what is running right now finally I can hear the fan running on this 48 volt 287 watts we are taking off from the uh, the load low amps I've never seen the wattage that low and everything is running I just showed you guys uh, a full size a full family size uh, refrigerator a chest freezer a water dispenser water fountain uh, 60 inches um, LED television still running on the background and the system is still standing now from float you went to MPPT float right now We only taking point or uh, one point two amps from the batteries with all our load, so we were running straight solar. Everything heavy duty stuff are running, I'm running. We're making power. Battery state of charge is one hundred and fifty amp power. Forty eight volt system. This is a forty eight volt system. If you are just joining in or you just stumble into this uh, channel we are running a 48 volt system here this is the fourth day of the test number four day of testing 48 volt system live here from the command center here is the time today is the second of May May 2nd we are still making power batteries have uh, 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 now on full charge I bet you if these batteries would have been no charge yet we would have seen how many amps and wattage that is coming in rushing into the batteries beautiful weather look at that look at that nice 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 all right folks 48 volt is working everything is working powered up all the routers modems for the communication powering the computer well i'm gonna be uploading this video soon everything is running everything is running my network system is running well folks you guys that don't even know I am running on this device I have um, a Verizon um, modem this is a dongle right there plug on the USB and a cradle point cradle point is just awesome 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 little device if you guys are like um, international you're going for vacation another country just buy um, uh, a USB modem like uh, a T-Mobile or anyone that uses a SIM card and you can able to activate that and just plug into this thing. This is a little router, it's a Wi-Fi uh, capability as well. So um, I used to go through uh, Ethernet, uh, sorry, um, a, a wife um, hotspot finally and I uh, have I decided to go through this road and get um, this guy right here it's a link linksys just a um, network hub so now I'm powering everything so and uh, classic is powered through that with this little guy 
Yeah, I'm just, I don't have a internet. I'm using just a, a prepay device right here. I can able to use because, you know, I don't need uh, the internet at all. So this is just a mobile thing, portable thing, which uh, normally I've been having for years. You know, with all we get spoiled with all this phone system. Nowadays, we, we can do anything you want to do now. You don't have to have a home internet at, at, at all. So pretty soon we go into the system and log into um, my, this is my 23 inches Asus. It's a HDMI monitor. Asus right there, 23, 24 inches big. So this is what I have a, a snapshot of my system and put as a background picture right there. So this is what you're seeing right now. Let's check the power. Still sitting at the float mode right here. And before we go to the local app, I just want to show you. 100%, 82 VOC bring in 5.2 amps That's the amps right there. 2.94 314 watts. Sorry for the light. 314 15 watts coming out from the system with all the load. System is awesome. Awesome, awesome. It's running really really good and efficient. Can't believe how many watts I'm pulling in from the inverter and uh, it's still it's too low compared even when I was running a 24 volt and a 12 volt system. Would have been really, really high with a 12 volt. I'm really happy with this. I'm really happy. So let's go to the program here and show you guys. There you go. See that? Find it right away. Ha! Look at that. Fixed it. Fixed it. Really happy. Thank God and uh, got this stuff running. Now I can go live. 
I just have to um, I don't know yet how to get to um, to be honest with you I don't know yet how to get to the uh, how I can able to see this thing live with my cell phone or when I'm away from home to see how I can able to uh, monitor my system and I'm trying to figure it out I know people are doing it right now but um, or maybe I just have to call midnight uh, classic midnight solar they will tell me but anyway system is working 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 see what we're bringing in 69 volts we made point one kilowatt hours 285 battery SOC is a hundred percent 150 amp hour battery bank 5.4 amps coming into the battery the batteries are sitting at 51.7 volts we are doing pretty good we are running house is running full time the network is doing its job check the critical point okay it's a nice 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 this here's the box right here right there that's the critical point technology 3g slash 4g mobile broadband router so the thing is you don't have to have a cable um, AT&T DSL you know CenturyLink all these uh, satellite uh, 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 um, internet you can buy this guy just with this guy you don't have to be on a contract at all. You don't have to be in a contract. See, these are just technology you can able to utilize. Everything supposed to work really portable. You have to remember, if anything happen, lines are crushed, power line, power is down, and how can you get your internet if there is something happen like the the poles, um, the electric poles or the internet poles out there or maybe a transformer blew up as long as the towers are up as long as the towers are up the towers are up running nothing wrong with the towers I can get my uh, uh, my access through the um, the towers then I can get my internet I can do my thing this is the one old reason about being off grid. This is the reason you have to, you have to um, have a way when something happen, you can able to sustain. You can able to live your life as normal. Nothing worries you. Nothing is gonna, um, um, you know. You have your freezer, your fridge, and all your stuff. Everything is running for you. You don't have to worry why other people are running around going crazy and you are fine see that that's what I'm talking about as long as I have the cell towers running they're up I'll be fine as long as mobile broadband is working cell phones are working from a distance I can still run my house I can able to watch local app I can see everything 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 and you don't have to have all the gears and have to spend a hundred and fifty dollars cable internet and all uh, 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 cable internet and um, satellite and all the stuff you know I don't have cable you know I don't have satellites what I have is here all I have is that FTA free to air and is free right there I install it check out my video FTA satellite Sun is still nice out there bright beautiful so this is the deal folks this is the deal FTA free to air satellite it works 
I have my channels there. I can get all the news I want. I don't care for whatever people say. Oh, this. I'm not missing anything. I'm learning to be uh, off greeter and I've been doing this for five years and uh, I'm fine. So you just have to have all the um, little technology, little gadgets, everything, then you can sustain your life. See, this is my just my network. This is what I set up. Look it up. Critical point CTR, like Charlie, Tongo, Robert. And uh, 500. Look at that model. It used to be really, really expensive back then. I bought it uh, years ago. And I'm saying if I happen to I travel, go overseas, I can able to use it. But look at this. She not just pretty. It's working, working, working. And remember when 9-11 happened. The only uh, company that was uh, running, that stay up running, is Verizon. So that's one of the reasons, because Verizon can able to uh, operate um, in analog, digital, and they have a lot of uh, long range of, um, of uh, uh, service, and they have a, the, 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 the um, credibility is really good, the reputation is good. And I can able to access all my devices through through this guy with a Wi-Fi system. You know, my television is a Wi-Fi. I can run. I can run Ethernet. I can run uh, Wi-Fi direct. It connects direct, so I don't have to worry about anything. A lot of wires and all that kind of stuff. This is just a messy setup right here. I just want to show you guys. Everything is running on solar. 301 watts coming in from the station right there. 67. Two, 0 0.2 kilowatt we just made. 51.7 volts. The batteries are sitting on it. And uh, 5.8 amps coming live from the battery, from the thing, the array. So back to this, we are we are running, and I can prove 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 things to you guys all the time. This is a learning channel. This is a way technological, and um, this is how you run system. This is how you run the off grid system. Don't rely to the grid that much. Ha! The fan just kind of uh, cool down because of um, nothing the load reduce some reason something happened look at this look at this setup folks learn from me because this is really a off grid I'm an off grader learn from me because uh, these things are the reality I'm telling you guys this is the reality I'm telling you guys you know, let's check. No update available at this time. You know, you can't just say I cut myself off from the grid, which um, you still have all your your stuff running wireless system running um sorry your internet running television cable television everything you know you got you have to win yourself out of that thing try to live one day without the uh the 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 the, the internet try to live one day without cable television you know try to live one day without uh the worldly things out there Trust me, a lot of people can't make it. A lot of people can't make it at all. Because we are spoiled with all the stuff. You know, including me. But so far, so good. This is how you should run a system. This is how 
a system should work. And thank God for all, uh, uh, um, for the ones that are supporting me and the ones who are subscribing to my channel. And thank you for all your good comments. And I also want to thank even the, um, the, uh, the, I also want to thank the procrastinators that is, oh, I'll do this someday. I'll do it. It's just, I'll do it. Oh, that's easy. It's not easy till you start. You have to start. If you don't start, it's not easy. But you got to untie yourself, untangle yourself and do this thing. You can do it. You can ask any of us on YouTube. Uh, people out there, smart, nice system, very intelligent. Some of them are not doing this thing, but they can just help because all what they uh, already knew. Just by learning everything. So, and they know. They don't have a solar system. They don't have a wind turbine system, but they can explain everything to you. Because they know it. Maybe sometimes they don't even have the money to do it. Or maybe just the opportunity. They don't have the land, they don't have a house, or maybe restrictions, or something, something like that. Some people just, they, they know things, but they don't want to just install it. They know it. But that's good. And they're out there helping. Look at this system running very, very good. Now I'm back to um, the classic right here. And the classic is just doing this thing. Trust me. It's just slapping all those power amps doesn't mean you have to do too much the batteries are full and we are running the entire house we are running the entire house everything i can't wait to see what this system can do in summertime if i can prove it now what about summertime it would be really really awesome look at that 908 from the station right here JW Solar USA We're making power Remember you guys on my video I was telling you guys This summer This year I'm going to be doing a lot of updates And upgrades I told you guys I told you You know I even talk about it, the wind turbine thing You know It takes time It takes time A lot of projects it takes time but it's coming, it's coming along. It's coming along with all you guys' support, with all you guys' um, uh, uh, um, comments, you know, with you guys' encouragement. You know, if you like to see this channel grow, we want to see this channel uh, really, really bringing you guys the latest and things about technology, tests, and all that stuff. Hey, I'm here for you guys. Just one thing you have to do, subscribe and push that uh, uh, thumbs up button and share the link with your friends and uh, family members loved ones you know this is how the channel is gonna grow if you guys only push that subscribe button then that will encourage me to uh, get a lot of um, um, high tech stuff and whatever to show you guys our system can go for off grader. I'm just I'm no I'm no competing nobody. I'm just showing you what I can do, what I can power my house. A house without electricity is not a house. You know you have to have electricity to power your needs. You have to have electricity to power your stuff and take care of yourself and your family. You know, well this is the thing. If I can do it, you guys can do it. You know, just little devices, eight modules, 160 watts, high tech solar panels, high tech incorporated solar panels. These are mono crystalline solar panels. You know, we're talking about 1.28 kilowatt right now. I'm not even touching that dial right now because the uh the, the, the it's not summer yet well thank you folks and have a blessed day subscribe please thumbs up
comment, give me your feedback and everything.